Hey guys, it's Adam aka Swimming Bird and welcome to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Gustin is going through some pretty big changes right now, and I'm not just talking about the beautiful fall foliage. As you can see, things are looking a little different here. I figured with our new villager Poppy moving in, I should clear out the crazy bamboo that has been spreading throughout the town, and I donned my samurai garb and got my golden axe and I went to chopping. I left a couple here kind of partially cut down. They look pretty nice, I think. Just the little bamboo stems sticking out, and they won't grow anymore. I tried to plant some more around my house, but I forgot that uh, flowers can plant on the sides, but the bamboo cannot, unfortunately. Ooh, let's grab those letters. We gotta finally read the last couple letters in here. There we go, perfect. I got three presents as well. Let's start off with one, and we're gonna go check out what's going on in Guston today. I like the little leaf and the, the Ronin hat. Nice little outfit. Ooh, the first one is from Cooper. Let's see. Dear Adam, a strange stork sent me this child's crib. Not knowing quite what to make of it, I thought it best to send your way, hoping you'd better suited to grasp the situation. D.B. Cooper. Okay, so we got some type of present thing. Let's open her up. It's a baby bed. <laughs> okay, I guess Cranston has been sending his baby beds out into the world. This one's from Elvis. To Adam, don't you think a room feels completely different if you change the carpet? Why not change things up with this? You probably get the suggestion a lot. Ha! That almost sounded like an insult. Does he not like my carpet? I just got that cheese rug last time, so what did he give me? A bamboo flooring. I already have that in one of my rooms. Maybe he's thinking about all the bamboo. That's where all the bamboo went. He used it to make a carpet. So, yeah, without the bamboo, it's looking a little less Japanese here. We got the town hall. Whoa! <laughs> and the, uh, the, the samurai walking around, so it has that nice feel to it. I'm still thinking about what I want to do with decorating the town like we have this huge field of flowers it's really unnecessary now i was kind of doing it to make sure we got the perfect town rating but now we have so many flowers i've been trying to sell them slowly you can see there's spots missing here because i'd like to fill these spots with something a little more interesting like a public works project or something we might as well change this while we're at it let's put a new design on this standee i went and grabbed this one out of retirement so we can advertise tiny sores i gotta get back on that too I have all these little tiny sore models, but it's such a mess in there. Man, the flowers are the new bamboo. They're just out of control here, growing everywhere. So let's check out the bulletin board. Ooh, I need to be catching insects and keeping track of their size because we got a bug off here, and I want to get that last piece of bug furniture. There we go. We got that walking leaf. It's so weird because it looks kind of like the, the leaf, you know, the objects thing, but it definitely doesn't. It's like a little off, so you can tell. So, ooh, the bug out. Yep, that's tomorrow. Oh, thanks to overwhelming support, we're expanding again. This is from TIY. So they're going to close the same day of the bug off. That's all right. I'll be uh, kind of busy trying to catch bugs and stuff. Let's go visit TIY real quick because I want to see if they... I think they might have like a going... Not going out of business, but a closing up sale. And we should get one last look. I've had this one for so long that it feels like it's going to be so weird to have it change. But it's for the better. We're going to get a lot more new stuff and expand their inventory. But I'm gonna miss these little guys with their Home Depot looking outfits. Oh, you, you don't know, know what that means, do you? I apologize for how sudden this is, but we're closing our shop on September 20th. After that, we'll be closed while we remodel the store. I apologize for the inconvenience. We ask for your understanding as we become an even better store, the best. So Tommy or, what was that, Timmy or Tommy? One of them isn't there, so it's kind of weird that they echo themselves. I always thought the other one was saying it. KK Safari, I don't think we have this one. Let's grab that. I don't know if they're, uh, yeah, it looks like it was on sale, yeah, so they are having, like, a closing sale. There's a little weird cat person running by. Ooh, is this a baby bed, too? Oh, it's a cradle, okay. We got, got a lot of weird baby-related thing. We keep getting references to the bamboo, and then we got another <laughs> baby thing. I'll come back and grab those fortune cookies and stuff later. Gonna go visit Leaf one last time, too. I think he will, uh, probably expand with the store, and, uh, he's not going anywhere, hopefully, but... He won't have his own little nook, maybe. Oh, you might have heard the news, but when DIY closes its doors tonight, it closes for good. Oh no, that means today is the last day for the gardening corner, too. If you need something, make sure to pick it up today. He's making it sound like that we're not going to have any more gardening stuff, but I think we're actually going to expand. Like, we can get fertilizer. We can finally get the golden shovel. I'm getting pretty close here. Once winter hits, we should be able to get all of the bugs and uh, then we can get the golden net at least. It's probably going to take a bit longer to get the golden uh, fishing rod because I think we need to... There's a couple things in the spring that we have to catch, but we're on our way to getting the golden tools. I have a uh, 
a painting that I bought from Graham, a dynamic painting. I can't remember if we already have one in the museum, so let's see. Let's see if that little otaku Graham just scammed me out of a couple thousand. There we go. Ooh, this isn't one we have yet. Let's see. Is it a fake? Oh, oop, maybe it, oh, oh no, yep. He sold me a fake. Jeez, all right. Well, I guess if it looks nice, maybe I'll put it in the house. I can't believe it, Graham. You little hamster. That's what he is. <laughs> I feel like it's a risk to buy the paintings from the villagers, but if you want it, that's probably the thing that will take the longest to fill up. The bugs are almost done, like I mentioned. The dinosaurs, uh, the fossils and different stuff, we're doing pretty good with. But yeah, it's like we are, uh, it's going to be a while before we can get all the paintings and works of art in the museum. But we're, we're on the way. I, I, I think that's one of my final goals too, is to complete the museum, have a fully expanded house, all that good stuff. I want to get all that done. The grass really does look like a weird shade of like yellow green. It's kind of cool. I was expecting the, the trees to get a bit darker, but maybe we haven't quite gotten to that yet. It looks like no one's at the campground. That's okay, we have a full town. Hopefully someone else will leave here soon, because I'd like to get uh, the types of villagers that we don't have yet. Let me see. We could ask Copper what's going on, but it might just be happening over here. Yep. Ooh, we got red. Let's go check this out. Speaking of works of art, we really need to get the rest of those filled up, so hopefully we can get a new one here. Okay. Well, we already have that one, and I know the one on the right. I know that that is fake because there's only one baby under there. And I think the Romulus Remus thing with the wolves, I think it's usually two. So that's fake, I believe. I'm not so great with the paintings. That shell one, I can't remember. Yeah, these are all like paintings and I'm like, I don't remember. Okay, I think this one is the real one. And I can't remember if I've got the amazing painting already in the museum, but might as well buy it. It's not that expensive. There we go. The other ones were fake because the, uh, the one is, uh, <laughs> the lady is like double tall over here I can show you and then the shell on this one the shell should not be facing down it should be facing up and then this one look how tall that lady is in the center she shouldn't be like that tall compared to everybody okay so we'll find out I'm pretty sure that one at least we got one real painting today even though we got a fake one I want to go uh, talk to some villagers and see what they're up to as well I'm not sure if this is whoa just looked a lot brighter for some reason when it came out yeah, you can see some of the trees, they're not... Oop, I just got some money. I was just shaking it randomly. But the, some of these are still green because they're not fruit trees. It's a nice way to kind of tell them apart. I think we had something in summer that let us kind of identify that. So this is the other area of the bamboo scourge. And I, uh, I chopped those. I'll probably just leave a couple of them cut like that because I think that's a nice look to it. I need to be catching bugs while I'm at it. Let me grab whatever this is. No, don't do it! You got so much to live for! You're going to be a prized bug. There we go, rice grasshopper. In some regions, that's called a locust, because I was trying to make sure I got everything, and I saw that I needed a locust, and I was like, there aren't any locusts, I don't think. Or there's different types of them, but yeah. Let's talk to Genji. What are you doing, buddy? Ooh, tiny, hey! Oh my! You've got a rosy glow about you. You must be working out. So what's up, bro? Let's talk. What's going on? You ready for my tongue twister challenge? He even works out his tongue, jeez. He's such an exercise nut. Cause here we go. She sells seashells by the seashore. She sells, she sells. That's it. <laughs> now answer the question. How many swirs were in there? Oh geez. She sells. She. Sh oh my gosh. I don't know. I'm gonna guess 18. I guess. I don't know. Nope. That's not it. You were way off. Oh my. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I just. Uh, I wasn't thinking about that. It's not the SATs or something. Okay, Pinky, we're trying to give Pinky the silent treatment. I feel bad. We talked to her on her birthday, I think. Or at least we went and visited her. What should we... I don't know if we have any public works going on right now. Let's do a little bit of Marin. We haven't done any, like, direct Marin in a while. <laughs> so let's go Marit up and see if we have any public works that are interesting enough to put in some of the spots now that things are clearing up in Gooston. We got some extra areas getting rid of some of the plants. Is there something I can help you with? Let's check out Public Works, because I think we haven't done one in a while. Let's start a new project. Okay, so here are the requests. I don't know if I had anything that uh, interesting, or I probably would have started it. There's, We could do a pile of pipes. <laughs> oh, we haven't done a well, have we? Some of these are pretty nice. A street lamp? They're so expensive, though. A balloon arch. Fence. We've done some of these. Like, we got the uh, Isabelle's bathroom there. The fire hydrant. Whoa! cube sculpture that's so expensive it's a little too modern i like the chair one it's like a big boot it's kind of cool 
Some of these are so weird. There's an amazing tower, but that is so expensive as well, and a flower clock. Where should we put the tower? Let me uh, leave a comment if you want to see any of these built, because I'm not sure with some of them. Like the cube and the, the tower are so expensive, but I would build them if it, you guys can think of a good spot for it and like you think it would go well. I've got a more rustic town, I think, so a lot of these are more modern, so I feel like they might stick out. I really want to get some of the more, uh, like there's some zen, like garden, different cool stuff that I think would fit well in here with the, the way the town hall is and everything. And uh, I think you have to get the grumpy villager or the cranky villagers to request them, though, unfortunately. So I gotta, like, make sure Elvis is, uh, is requesting. I know there's different ways to do that. Avery was thinking about something. Oh, hello. Maybe she'll request one, because she's kind of grumpy. Here, I found something that's so perfect for you, Dumpling. It's a genie shirt. Okay, Avery, is he? Okay, <laughs> he was just walking into me. <laughs> Are you blind or you just can't see forward, Avery? I'm getting rid of some stuff, and I thought you might like my genie shirt. Not your style? Well, the garbage can is right over there if you want to be polite. Just wait until I leave. There is a... I think you can build a trash can that's public, but I've got one in my house to dispose stuff. I think I've had a genie shirt before. Whoa! Hey, this is blooming. I don't think I ever noticed that. I wonder... I know the bushes only bloom during certain times of the year, and some of these down here... Yeah, these haven't been active in a while. It's very strange. They're all different types, but I don't remember what <laughs> it's what. Anyways... That's probably it for today. I, I need to start getting onto my coffee stuff again because I think we still have another gyroid and do some more part-time work. And uh, we're going to have the bug off next time and the store will be closed. Lots of stuff happening, Gustin. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to go see if there's any other bamboo to vanquish. Yeah, <laughs> Practice for Smash using my axe. I'll see you guys next time for more Animal Crossing. Goodbye.